Hey guys, this is Tonner and today we've got new data mines. Uh, these are obviously going to be pretty important because this is about upcoming events and stuff like that. So that way you guys know. Now there's a couple of things that I want to talk about quickly before that. One is that if you enjoy data mining and you want to know about the future of the Marvel Strike Force, make sure you subscribe to the channel because we talk about all this here as well as go over to my Discord so you can get first looked at them. Uh, we basically have all the information that ends up in the blogs before the blogs come out. And I know that probably frustrates some people over at Boundless, but it gets me, allows me to be able to give you extra um, alert for stuff. So uh, the other thing I wanted to talk about is once again, Boundless have nerfed the monthly calendar. If we have a look at this one from February, you'll notice the cores here, 75, 100, 125, 175, and 250. And then today it's 50, 75, 100, 150, 200. Like they've nerfed it by like, what's that? 50... Uh, 250, uh, 150 cores or something like that. Because each of these are reduced by 100 and then this last one's reduced by, you know, 50. Uh, they've also removed all the gold orb. Like, the, there's it meant to be, you know, a whole gold orb in here that they've removed there. And uh, even this gold is reduced by half <laughs> this calendar. Like, the calendars just keep getting worse. If we have a look back in... Uh, all August, and huge shout out to my Discord for passing these along to me. We actually had like, you know, 1.4 mil gold in here. 1.4 mil gold in there. Um, and yeah, it, it's. This was a this was a calendar from like April until August and stuff, and it was a hundred, two hundred, three hundred, then 1.4 mil, and they just reduced that there. Um, I don't know. They increase some stuff in it. Like you get some more catalysts and stuff, but now they've, you know, nerfed the cores again, nerfed the gold again. Anyway, uh, so data mines. Data mines. So the upcoming blog this Friday is going to be complete apocalypse saga details, memory lane events, returning classic content. There's also was changes to the Thanos event in the file. So the Thanos event is going to be coming back, um, which was, you know, like... It was kind of like an event campaign that you could just do once. It was like, you know, like the, the Crossbones one and the Electra one. So that looks like that's coming back. So in here, we're going to have, you know, the Apocalypse Saga, which, which is very interesting given that, you know, this one and the next one, these there's only two blogs until the next patch. So um, I'll be very interested to see exactly what is coming next patch because there's only, you know, two blogs and no announcement this week. Uh, so that means that, you know, there's only going to be one blog between like that could potentially have stuff unless they decide to do like a midweek blog or something. All right. Now the, the annoying one. <laughs> so this is coming soon for Moonstone. Obviously Moonstone is just around the corner. Um, and this is going to be how to recruit her. They also mentioned about Quicksilver in here. I love how they mentioned about Quicksilver, but they never mention about the legendary that like these guys are meant to be required for a legendary. Are they not required for a legendary anymore? What's going on there? But this is the one that's going to piss people off. So, um, she's going to be the to the moon event. All right. Um, actually, we'll, we'll get to what's going to piss people off in a minute. So, the to the moon event is what you're going to be at Moonstone from. And we know when that is. That's going to be the 20th of uh, March. 20th of March is when that event's coming. Uh, again, they mentioned about Quicksilver there. The Apocalypse Saga. Um, so, in here, we've got the hard rewards. Tier 4 ions. It does not mention Tier 5 ions coming from Heroic. It does have Apocalypse Saga. Char uh, Apocalypse character shards getting your 5 star. 2 red stars for Apocalypse there. Um and that's basically just, you know, the requirements here. You're going to need um, the gear T17, tier, tier 2, level 5, I, or the ISO. God, that's such a mouthful. Um, and that gets you more tier 2, level 5 ions for getting the 7-star apocalypse too. So, interesting. Um, so, this one here. This is the cold storage event. It's going to be, you know, doing Cosmic Crucible, boost your Cosmic Crucible character, stockpile valuable resources. So to complete this, you are going to need to earn Cosmic Crucible credits. So let's have a look at when this is. So this is the cold storage event, which is March the 6th. Save your Cosmic Crucible credits right now. Like, just start saving them. The one that comes out, like, in a couple days, save the Cosmic Crucible credits mail that comes in. You're going to need it. You're going to want it. It's going to be very important. So, March the 6th. Now, again, keep note, March the 20th. So, earning Cosmic Crucible credits. 
battling in Cosmic Crucible with Moonstone. So you're going to need to battle in Cosmic Crucible with Moonstone to be able to do this. Again, look at the dates here. This event is March the 6th, you know, this week. Well, next week, technically. But the other one is going to be March the 20th. So free to play have no chance of being able to get Moonstone without using cores before this event happens. So you thought the Kang event was bad? Well, now we're doing Kang 2.0. Um, this is this is actually hilarious because most likely you'll probably get like, you know, a whole bunch of points for using Moonstone to reward those people. The good thing is that next month's event is basically, you know, skippable. Like there's no new character tied to the monthly event or anything like that. You're going to miss out on some stuff like Tangled Web shards, you know, miss out on those Spider Weaver shards. Just what you always wanted. Uh, Masters of Evil Shards. Now, I know this says Masters of Evil Shards, so you're probably thinking, Tawny, you probably just get Moonstone from the Milestone. No. No, you don't get Moonstone from this one. This is, like, if Moonstone was coming from this one, it would have listed, you know, the cold storage event in here. But no. So, yeah. Uh, have fun with that. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. what I, I start to question the sanity of the people who are working over there. Uh, I know a big peep, I know that someone's gonna come in and they're gonna be like, Torna, the game is ending. The game is dying. No, Marvel Strike Force is not dying. Are they trying to kill it? No, <laughs> they won't try and kill it. They're just trying to make a whole lot of money and they just don't seemingly realize the uh, effect it's having on the community. Uh, they don't intentionally want to kill Marvel Strike Force. They don't. In they're not intentionally uh, making it die. They're just, you know, I'm going to say incompetent. <laughs> um, but that's it today, guys. Uh, have fun battling in Cosmic Crucible with your zero star mo Moonstone, unless you buy her or bu spending calls on her. Bye.